I should probably start vlogging for vlog tour. But hello, walls. How are you? I'm currently actually uh, sprinting. Uh, we have winter sprints now, and press with her sushis joined us. But today, um, it's I mean, it's not today the special day or whatever, but October is our patron first anniversary, so it's. October is special, then Halloween, then we have my birthday, we have so many good things happening in October. Uh, so it's a pretty good month and we got some puppies over there. I don't know if you can see uh, Mooney and Nova here, but I was like, yeah, I might as well start my vlog tour because I haven't started it and I already did a lot in October. On Saturday, we had a uh, live show for the Howling Pack. And then on Sunday, we had the live show for Bye Bye, for um, the Read Along Queens, the Read Along we are doing uh, with the Winter Pack, and I had uh, a live show for Rings of Power as well. So that was quite exciting. Let me close the door. So a lot of things are actually happening in October. Uh, so that's uh, really quite exciting. Uh, but I've read half of kings of the wild in october and i have read uh, started and finished northern lights on sunday today is tuesday so i'm gonna actually start another book i oh i have also started um uh, unlocked which is uh keep of the cities 8.5 so that's already a lot and now i'm gonna start this one with each blah blah which seems very appropriate october october uh, we live in the woods and we are wild. I don't know much more about it except that it's October October The book has a very nice pastel yellow. I mean it looks brighter on the camera. Of course it looks brighter on the camera, whatever uh, beautiful spine as well and It has a little owl over here, which I really love. So I'm gonna say that one All I know about is that it is a middle grade and I don't know anything else about it so that's gonna be a nice surprise so let me know how you're doing how is october treating you because uh, i'm gonna try to weekly vlog for vlogtober it's not like daily vlog that would just be insane for me uh but weekly vlogs but yeah let me know how you're doing what you are reading what you are planning on doing in october and i really hope you're good and that you're ready for these weekly vlogs but yeah it's already sunday I don't know how come I'm having such a trouble with like filming weekly vlogs because I keep forgetting about vlogging or whatever. And it's already Sunday. The only update I can give you is that I actually finished that one. I gave it three stars. It's not really what I expected because I expected something fantasy-esque or at least a little bit. No, but when you read the synopsis, you will understand that it has nothing to do with fantasy or anything like that. It's basically a little girl who lives with her father in the wilderness, like two hours from London in the wild, whatever. And she's really happy there, but something is going to happen to her dad and he's going to need to go to the hospital. And actually her mother left her behind because she couldn't cope with the nature. She needed the downtown London, and which is absolutely fair, like people are different or whatever. It's not fair to the girl, but it's fair to feel more comfortable in the city or in the world or whatever. And uh, because of that accident with her dad, she has to go to her mother, which she doesn't know because she has never been in contact with her just because she refused and everything. And it's basically about that. And I really enjoyed the book. It's quite emotional and everything, but it's not what I expected. So three stars. I so enjoyed it. And the name of the character is actually October, which I really love. It's weird but i really love it and also then i wanted to start um the sequel to foundry side and i was like no no uh because it's here somewhere you know in one of these boxes and wait nova is crying sometimes she just gets scared of the stairs i don't know why and she stops in the middle of it and then starts crying whatever but i was saying the book is here in the pile and i'm just like I have other books I can read, uh, you know, that are here or whatever, but uh, I need to finish Keep Out the Last City, I need to read From the Side 2, I need to read Into the Drowning Deep, I could start Into the Drowning Deep 
And if I'm done with that one, then I'm gonna open the parcel because I think these two are books that I have ordered and these two are actually from the side two and three or two and three, whatever. So yeah, I hate a tripod <laughs> every time I have to vlog. So that's probably because I hate a tripod that I don't film vlogs. I don't know, but yeah, that's it, I think. I don't know what else to tell you, but yeah, I should probably start into the drawing deep then. Which I'm sure it's gonna be a five star. Oh, that was also a gift by Liane. Oh, I forgot that this one was a gift as well, but I think I'm gonna start this one. Uh, I don't know when, probably on Monday, next week. <laughs> I mean, tomorrow. Um, but yeah, that's it. I will update you a bit later with things, but it's probably gonna be a short vlog. <laughs> Uh, I don't know why it's such a trouble to film vlogs, but I can wait for... Oh yeah, in case you didn't know, I will put the link down below. But next Saturday, I will be actually opening all the parcels live, available to everyone. And yeah. <laughs> you want to say hello? Hello. 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 Mo oh, baby, what you gonna do? Where you gonna go? Ooh. Oh, you gonna sleep. What about you, Nova? You gonna sleep here? <laughs> um, so yeah, a few hours later and I'm still in the same outfit and everything because uh, I just watched uh, with the winter pack um, episode Six and seven of Rings of Power. We have thoughts. <laughs> I'm not gonna share them here, but we have thoughts. <laughs> um, so yeah, I did not do any other readings, whatever. Uh, so I don't really have any updates for you, except that I will be opening probably two parcels here. That would have been easier. Uh, I'm gonna open probably two parcels. Whoa. I cannot vlog here. Uh, what? You want the camera? You want it? <laughs> no, you cannot eat that. What? No, don't touch my plant. I don't know what you're doing. I don't even know if you're in the frame. Editing Sasha will see. <laughs> she doesn't know what she wants. I feel like she's tired, but she doesn't know. If you can see her. Um, but yeah, so I don't really have many updates to give you. It's going to be a very, very uh, short and maybe lame vlog. So hopefully next week is going to be better. But ne next week is uh, Wacky Witches. It's happening. So I might have more content. Also, tomorrow I am going apparently shopping in the Netherlands. So we're gonna do that, and three. Oh yeah, my birthday is on Saturday, so I will open gifts and everything. So I might record a few things. Yeah, I might have a more interesting week actually next week. So hopefully that will be a bit of a lot better content. Uh, but so far, yeah. Also, do you like this? Paul Norris with an orca killing whale. Do you like it? I do like it very much <laughs> and I love that uh, dark forest green it's very comfy it's very like I was in my shirt like soft in the inside so I love it very much um I don't know what she's doing I don't even know if you know about her I know the winter pack does but I don't know if I announced it publicly here but she's Nova <laughs> um yeah I, i'm gonna stop oh i just got a good news you know my uh, i have a tarot deck which is true black tarot i will link it down below the creator the artist it's just like on another level because the cards like the tarot deck is absolutely amazing and they are having uh a new one so they have created like this one was the black tarot deck and now they have the opposite 
so they have the white one with gold and i need it i need it i just like that's the only tarot deck that i have and i'm not planning on buying more i have multiple oracle decks but not tarot that one is the only one i want and the white one is just as beautiful as the black one so i need it because that artist is just like freaking amazing um so i was planning on actually uh gifting myself something but i will not do that because i want to get that deck um so yeah but yeah yeah just let me know about yourself because i talk about me here so please let me know about yourself and uh have you read into the drowning deep because that's going to be my next read and that's actually for the howling pack it sounds very like fantasy sci-fi ish with a uh, very horror ish something there was a lot of ish ishes there was a lot of ish oh ishes question for you <laughs> but i'm very excited about this one very much excited um but yeah let me know let's try this again because last week was a bit lame but today it's already tuesday so i'm not starting well but yesterday oh my god i don't know why i'm so <laughs> hyped or whatever yesterday i went to the netherlands to uh, Roermond, uh which is like an outlet place it's beautiful i did not film it because it was like my official day off like just doing things for myself not for content or work or anything um but it's basically a place in the netherlands where you have so many shops not like just everyday shop but more like high brands you would have like also you also had like nike etc but it's quite expensive and i'm not how do you say it do you say nike or nike in belgium we say nike and i feel like in england you say nike as well but when i was in canada everyone was saying nike so do you say nike or nike that's the first question but then you have like some creators like you know designers uh shops etc you have like brands that are not that uh, affordable but you have huge discounts on a lot of items i would say 95 percent to like 98 percent of the items were discounted i just saw like some um underwears at puma that were not discounted uh but the rest was and it was quite in interesting for instance i bought for 70 percent of 70 percent 70 euros 70 euros of uh things from the body shop and at the shop i would have paid 135 or something like that because you can see the price uh from the outlet but also from the regular shop etc so it is indeed quite interesting uh it's two hours a bit less than two hours from where i am so i feel like going there every every few months to just restock on the body shop but also other things is good it was interesting i saw a few things that i really liked like clothing wise um but i'm waiting to save up a little bit of money before like going there and spending it because even though it is like instead of 300 euros you might have it for 120 and it's like from the past years kind of thing you know it's not like the last design that came or whatever so it is still very interesting but maybe an, an excitement but i don't have much like i bought a few things from the body shop and then said my mom and my brother did buy uh, buy a few things so i very interesting price uh, my mom bought like something from timberland i love timberland brand but i don't buy their shoes because they're real leather and i feel so i mean i feel cheated i hope they had like some leather free kind of options because it, those shoes are beautiful uh but also another brand that i love is hug 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 ugg i don't know how you say that but again it's cheap so i i i don't buy it but i love those like kind of boots but you have so many so many so many shops there and I really enjoy the place and it's like a little village it's beautiful and the parking is almost free like for a little bit over four hours we paid four euros when you go to the hospital here for three hours you pay 11 euros so it's quite affordable 
but yeah so i was happy about that it was me discovering that place and i'm definitely going back there but reading wise so it is uh wacky witches this week and i also need to finish uh dinoween dinoween is a readathon i created which mixes halloween and dinosaurs for the winter bags of patron and i have a book i need to read but i don't know if it goes with wacky witches let me check if there is like um a prompt for which it could go because that would be like amazing okay 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 so we have oh read a book at night read at night beautiful cover as well no it doesn't have a green cover yeah so it could definitely go for a prompt and that's actually this one so i need to read into the drowning deep by mira grant which is shannon mcguire it is a horror sci-fi ish fantasy ish book with apparently a crew who went to uh you know to australia or whatever to actually film a mockumentary about something that's happening at a certain place which is like the mariana mariana trench i believe yes and because everyone believes that there is like some kind of magical sea creatures or ancient or whatever but no one believes that you know it's like no one believes it but they're going there and something actually happens so i want to read that one so that's what i'm gonna do let me know what your plan is or was for last week and what it is for next week um but yeah that's that's it I was at my grandparents this morning and I got an email uh, by like from UPS telling me oh a parcel just got delivered I was not expecting to get back to this thank you <laughs> oh my god I don't know where to put everything my desk is already full I used to put everything there in the corner but oh I don't know where I'm gonna put everything now But that's a nice problem to have, I guess. <laughs> wow, hello, it's Thursday and I'm actually sprinting with press here. I don't know if you can see, but yeah. So, uh, I don't know if you can see, but we have quite some parcels here I will need to open on Saturday. Also, I'm reading, but I have so many things to do. Wow, I don't even know. I'm so hyped, whatever. You know that I talked to you about this book that I needed actually to read. I read a few chapters. I am very much enjoying it but then I need to work on a few things so I was like hey may I as well pick another book for the sprint with press because we started at 1 p.m and we'll probably read for the entire day so I actually picked this one so the language of ghost by Hedda Fawcett she wrote another series that I really enjoy like even the darkest stars which is a duology if you want to get into a polar fantasy a YA duology not a trilogy so you don't have to commit just as much uh, I would recommend that series so I'm listening to this one while I'm working on some things and it is quite good so far so I, I cannot tell you what it is about exactly because I've just read like the prologue <laughs> but apparently someone was forced into exile uh, on an uh, enchanted moving island, ex-princess Noah Marchena has two missions. Reclaim her family's stolen throne and ensure that the dark powers her older brother Julian possesses don't go to his side uh, in the process. So I'm intrigued, but that's pretty much all I have to tell you. Oh, also, I'm having this snack. And you know how sometimes you get some pictures of things and then the inside is quite different. But here we really have like some bats. And we do have let me, a ghost here. So we really do have what's on the package, which I'm really excited about because usually it's not the case. So, and it's good. It tastes like lighted salty chip, which is good. So, yeah. I just opened all my parcels. It's a mess. Uh, we're live and I just wanted to say thank you I'm overwhelmed by everything I got like amazing books I mean all the books sounds like amazing and something I want to read like ASAP I got crystals I got a cute mug I got uh, the necklace here I got I was spoiled 
I was spoiled. I don't. I. I, I was spoiled. <laughs> Thank you. But yeah, it's my birthday actually. I don't know. <laughs> you know from the vlog. Um, I'm gonna clean the mess because it's quite messy. Uh, but I want to say again, thank you for all the gifts, uh, thank you for your support, thank you for um, staying with me <laughs> even when I'm annoying or a little bit absent. Um, I'm overwhelmed, but thank you. <laughs> Hello. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Where are you going? You want to show your face? Hello! <laughs> I was not expecting that little... Oh, that little one? Where are you going? You gonna sit here? She's gonna be there. That's her favorite spot in this room. Here, just next to me. Huh? You cute. But yeah, I'm about to wrap up the previous vlog. Um, so, I, I mean, it's obviously not going to be a weekly vlog because I'm going to combine first week and second week and it's already Tuesday, so I need to start uh, the new vlog. And yeah, it's a bit of a mess, but my life is hectic. You you don't see it, but I swear to God, it's even more than before. Um, but I want to show you the pile of books I need to read and that I'm going to have to read in the next two weeks. It's a bit, a lot challenging. But I think we can do it with lots of strengths. But we have this one, Into the Drowning Deep, which I've started. And so far it is, like, sp not spooky, but horror-ish. But more than I expected it to be, even if I knew it would be. So that's good. I need to read this one for uh, Tackling Tombs for a Press Book Club. You want to go outside or want to go inside? You pick. Outside, inside. Good. So I need to finish it. I mean, I need to start it and finish it. Sorry for the little interruption. I also need to start and finish this one, which is a sequel to Fondreside, uh, because um, Read on Queens. And then we have this one with the winter pack. I cannot wait to get to that one. It's going to be super fast because I'm listening, like I will be listening to the other book at the same time. So it's going to be nice. And it is a reread, first time in English, but it's still a reread. Um, and I'm excited for all of them, actually. There is not one book I'm more excited about uh, one than the other, if that makes any sense. But I'm super excited for all the books I have here that you cannot see. Move, Sasha. There, all the books. I got so excited for them, so <sighs> thank you again for everything. My head is a bit killing, so if I don't make sense, that's what's happening. Oh, also, I wanted to show you two more things that I got. I don't think I, I showed you everything I got for Halloween, but it doesn't matter. I got this from my mom, and I think it has some lights. Hello, you. Yes, there is a bit of light in the eyes. So that's cute and also this one but i need to put like batteries in yes. so i'm gonna put everything on my desk i'll try to find a place where to put everything i need to figure out because that's big <laughs> but yeah uh i hope you enjoyed this mess of a two weeks vlog and uh, let me know what you've read what you're planning on reading the rest of the month and everything what you're looking forward to November. Don't forget that I'm part of a new readathon that was created. The link is going to be down below. It is Once Upon a Readathon that uh, was created and I'm so excited for it. I was asked to be a co-host so thank you so much for asking me to be a co-host for Team Wolves. So of course you can join any team because all the teams are amazing with amazing creators uh, but Wolves <laughs> but you yeah, well, thank you so much for watching this vlog i really hope you enjoyed it if you did give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to be a part of the pack talk to me in the comment section as usual and until next time take care walls. Well.